If you add up 18 and 81, it equals to 99, which is the number of Allah's beautiful names that appear in the Quran. And if you subtract 18 from 81, that equals to 63. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, passed away at the age of 63. On your right hand, which I just outlined with a pen, is the number 18 in Arabic. This is the number 1 in Arabic, and this is the number 8 in Arabic, which is 18. And on your left hand is the number 81 in Arabic. This is the number 8 in Arabic, and that's the number 1 in Arabic, which is 81. If you add up 18 and 81, it equals to 99, which is the number of Allah's beautiful names that appear in the Quran. And if you subtract 18 from 81, that equals to 63. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, passed away at the age of 63. How do we know Allah has 99 names? Because it is already designed and planned and put in our hands. I did ask a um, couple of uh, beloveds to figure out if, um, if they are predestined by Allah and designed by Allah to know the 99 names of Allah and therefore like, are they belong to Allah or not. Let's start with this one first. You did an experiment, Hattie? I did experiment. <laughs> I did experiment. So let's deal with the first hand. What was the number? So you want 81 and 18? Yeah, 81. Number 8 and number 1. Do we see number 8 and number 1 in this one? Yeah, on the right hand side of the screen, she's got the number 1, which is a vertical line. And the number 8, which looks like uh, the two sides of a triangle on yep. either side. So yeah, so the one hand is right. But the other hand, the 1 I can see, but the 8... It's a bit dubious, sister. Okay, so I think we can kind of simply say this person doesn't have the names of Allah designed on her hands. Therefore, no. This person is not designed by, by Allah. She's misguided. She's intentionally being misguided. Allah is not one of her problem. There is another two hands. It doesn't look like this person um, has it again. So I think since we don't have 18 and 81 in these two hands, we can simply say this person was misguided and not designed by Allah and person should know the names of Allah. P please, please do check your hands, okay? I'm sure someone noticed this one. So this is someone with two right hands. I am so confident this person is not Allah. There are two individuals actually, you know the sign sure. But anyway, so they don't have the number 18 again in their hands or 81. All very handy, yeah. Let's try this one. Fair to say this one, if you push a little bit, yes, you do have 18 oh. in this. 18 and 81. Um, this brother is designed by Allah to have the number 99 in his hands. He has no reason to not know 99 names of Allah. 18 plus 81 is 99, and Allah has 99 names. Dawa Gangs was making a point that we are all kind of all have that in our hands. Yeah, we are all designed by Allah. I have here another brother. I must say this was the one of the best picture came in. Even though picture is very well taken, but I am afraid to tell you, you are not designed by Allah. You are masterpiece of Yahweh. You are not designed by Allah. And you don't have 18 and 81 in your hands, lovely brother. So did, did Allah just forget to put the numbers on yeah, the so hands? Allah, Allah intentionally forgot to put that. That proves that this Dawah gang, Adam Saleh, is just a clown and making things up. Is that, That's what I'm getting, sister. Muhammad died in age 63, according to the Islamic tradition. Okay. And I can simply tell you, yes, I do have 18 and 81. So therefore, I think <laughs> even though I am masterpiece which belong to Lord Jesus Christ, yet yeah. I've got Allah is like put into my hands. But I just wanted to point out something. Okay, so this is hand. Oh, I hope this is like, okay, this is the whiteboard. Fan. Okay. <laughs> so and then you've got, I've got this line as well. I, I would call them like they're my wrinkles. I've got my wrinkles in my <laughs> hand. Okay. So this doesn't look... Does this look like 18, no, sister? No, it doesn't. Are you sure? Because I have this line. So I, I do, think, do you think I need to need no more names of Allah than number? Maybe, maybe you need to get Botox for your hands to smooth oh. out the line that you don't want. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that I don't want it. It's there. So I've got like number 18. But also I've got like this extra line. And it is there. And it... 
gets rid of number 18. As it gets rid of number 18 and 81, it simply identifies me as the masterpiece of Yahweh. Okay? So, mm. I just thought we'd do this experiment. Why is he saying such ridiculous things? He's trying to make a case how Islam is universal um, religion. They have no other proof that their religion is true, so they have to go to such ridiculous things. Yeah. A bit like the number 19 that um, Mr. Shabir keeps talking about. The argument is, if you have a look at the lines on your hands and you pretend that they're lines that are numbers in Arabic, then you get 18 and 81, you add them together, you get 99, which is the 99 numbers of Allah. Wow, he stamped you because you're his creation. And then if you <laughs> take away 18 from uh, 81, you get 63, which is, wow, the number of years that Muhammad lived on, his, on this earth. Like, you're really reaching now. Like, we proved by this experiment that not everybody has the trademark of Allah. Not everybody has been stamped with these numbers on their hands, so... So, before Allah created me, like, we, we saw some of those hands. Before Allah created those individuals, Allah didn't put his mark in them. Serious question still stands. Why number of the angels needs to increase on that day, while it is four? So, Allah throne is physical throne. Physical beings are holding that throne. From, why from 4 to 8? Second question is, is it 8 or 8,000? I know only 0 is kind of changed the second number, but this 0 becomes very important in certain occasions. This is the answer. Here it is. Get ready to say Shahada now. Islam is the truth. truth. And truth, do not rely on numbers. So lost souls like you, Live Islam, it is your lust. Wait a minute. <laughs> Don't rely on numbers? They always tell you they're numbers. Where is, you, well, what just... happened to 18 and 81? <laughs> <laughs> 18 and 81, 63. You are, oh, you are telling me not rely on numbers? The miracle of 19, the number you are not, Quran. You are telling me to not rely on numbers? Don't say three. Go tell that to okay. Adam, Adam Saleh. Your, okay, your you are telling me to not rely again. on numbers and then this number is in my hand. If you add up 18 and 81, it equals to 99, which is the number of Allah's beautiful names that appear in the Quran. And if you subtract 18 from 81, that equals to 63. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, passed away at the age of 63.